This video is for all the professionals working on the profile of managers in social, community and correctional services and are willing to migrate to or work in Canada. It will provide you an in-depth knowledge about the National Occupational Classification Code of Managers in Social, Community and Correctional Services. So, let's start the video. Hi, I am Lily and welcome to our channel A to Z Immigration Updates. We make informational and latest news videos regarding global immigration. Watch this video till the end and don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon, so that you can get the most updated immigration news and information. In Canada every skill profile has a unique code that is called National Occupational Classification Code or NOC Code. This code tells us about the detailed information associated with the profile and regarding the key parameters like Profile Description or Profile Lead Statements Key Responsibility Area and Damp Main Job Duties Employment Requirements Alternative and Illustrative Job Titles Job Titles in Exclusion So, first of all let's see the NOC code and its description for the profile of this video. The National Occupation Classification Code or NOC Code for the Profile of Managers in Social, Community and Correctional Services is 423. As per Statistics Canada, the profile description of managers in social, community and correctional services is as follows. This unit group includes managers who plan, organize, direct, control and evaluate the programs and activities of social service and community agencies, correctional institutions, counseling departments, labor organizations, professional associations, political parties, and non-governmental organizations. Key Responsibility Area Human Resources and Skill Development Canada has defined a proper set of job roles for every NOC code. There is not any fixed guideline for meeting all the requirements. As per the recommendation of experts a person should meet at least 50% of the job responsibilities, mentioned in the NOC code. Now let's discuss the key job responsibilities associated with your profile. So, here we go. Main job duties of an managers in social, community and correctional services are as follows. Plan, organize, direct, control and evaluate the delivery of social and community service programs such as income maintenance, children's aid, and emergency housing services. Manage the operations and activities of social and community centers, correctional facilities, and detention centers. Administer the programs of non-governmental organizations involved with social issues such as health care, human rights, consumer protection, international development, and environmental protection. Administer programs of membership organizations such as political parties, labor organizations, business, and professional associations. Establish administrative procedures to meet objectives set by board of directors or senior management. Direct and advise professional and non-professional staff delivering services and programs to the general public and to the organization or association membership. Plan, administer and control budgets for programs, equipment, and support services. Represent their respective organizations for the purpose of government liaison and media relations. Participate in policy development by preparing reports and briefs for management committees and working groups. Hire and provide training for professional and non-professional staff. Employment requirements and other additional information. In this section we will discuss the employment requirements for your profile. Every job has a specific set of employment requirements associated with it. The main employment requirements factors includes 1. Type and level of formal education 2. Specific training or apprenticeship 3. Experience in the same or other related occupations 4. Licenses certification and registration to practice in a regulated profession extra. Before moving further let's understand the employment eligibility requirements and other additional information associated with your profile. Following our employment requirements for the profile of managers in social, community and correctional services. Managers in social, community and correctional services usually require a master's degree in a social science or administrative discipline and several years of experience in a related occupation 
such as a community and social service worker, social or health policy researcher, consultant or program officer, probation or parole officer, or social worker. Managers of associations and membership organizations require extensive experience in a related occupation, trade, or industry. Illustrative job titles and exclusions. Every job role or employment can have multiple profile titles. So if you are not able to find the exact job title for your profile then you need not to worry. Now we will see the list of illustrative and alternative titles for your profile. This section is a list of titles commonly used in the labor market. We will also see the exclusions list that is the list of titles that cannot be covered under your profile. So let's have a glimpse of it. Illustrative titles for the profile of managers in social, community and correctional services are as follows. Association Director Child Welfare Services Administrator Children's Aid Society Director Community Center Director The list is quite large, so, if you want to read all the alternative profile titles then you can pause this video and can have a proper glimpse. Now let's see the exclusion list. Government Managers, Health and Social Policy Development and Program Administration, C0411 Government Managers, Health and Social Policy Development and Program Administration. Senior Managers, Health, Education, Social and Community Services and Membership Organizations, C0014 Senior Managers, Health, Education, Social and Community Services and Membership Organizations. So, this was all about the profile of managers in social, community and correctional services with NOC code, 423. If you need any further information, then you can contact our team of expert registered migration and employment consultants. Our team will help you to explore the employment, work visa and other immigration opportunities for your profile in Canada and Australia. Click on the booking link mentioned in the description to reserve an expert session for a detailed discussion to explore your immigration opportunities. We also assist employers to file LMIA with Employment and Social Development Canada ESDC. So if you are an employer in Canada we can help you to get the best manpower for your company. Canadian immigration is a merit-based immigration process and your selection under most of the immigration programs depends upon your age, education, experience. English language capability, spouses' educations and experience, employment availability through LMIA, provincial nomination extra. We at Brain Drain Consultants Private Limited provide a one-stop online platform with all kind of immigration services for our global customers. You can have online consultancy sessions, assessment application filing and all kind of visa processing assistance by our team of experts. If you want to do a self-assessment and check your eligibility for immigration, then click on the link attached in the description and download our app to do your immigration assessment yourself. Also watch our other videos related to work visa filing and finding a job in Canada from your home country. So, if you like our video then don't forget to subscribe, like and share our YouTube channel. Also hit the bell icon to get the most updated information regarding global immigration. Thanks, and we will meet again with one another informative video soon.